Okay, so the question is, do we just let people make their own improvements and how tight a rope do we keep on things? It's really quite simple. The first and most important thing is you have to train your people like crazy. That's what we do in the morning meeting. We teach them what the eight ways are. We teach them the four criteria for making improvement. They understand what they're looking for. So that's number one, we train like crazy. The second thing we do to make sure we don't have people going off and doing wild, crazy things, although that happens, is we have lean leads. We have about eight or nine lean leads in the company that have been taught very heavily on what lean is. And the, oftentimes, if there's any question about an improvement, they'll bring in a lean lead real quick and say, hey, what do you think about this? I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that. Do you have any ideas? So we use their expertise to help them. And then we have people that are experts at implementing uh, these changes and making these improvements who have a lot of experience doing that. So it's a, a collaboration of a lot of different things or it's a culmination of a lot of different things heavy duty training, lean leads, and people who are really good at implementing and making changes and helping those people facilitate their changes. So that's how we do it, and it works pretty well. It's not perfect, we still make mistakes, but by and large, it's a really good system.